What's up everybody, it's Neil here with Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Today I'll be showing you a very cool mod that will enable some awesome gestures or some unique gestures to your Nexus 7. Um, preferably, you should be uh, running a stock launcher because uh, some launchers like I believe Nova and TouchWiz have some gesture controls already included so it can get a little bit, uh, you can find some conflict there but nonetheless, it's still a pretty cool mod. So let's check it out. I have a Nexus 7 here, obviously, and um, so basically you need it rooted and you need to have Exposed Framework installed. Both of those guys will be included in this article, so check it out on Nexus 7 Soft Modder. So after doing that, let's just show you briefly, you're going to go to your modules, you're going to check Gesture, Navigation, and then you're going to go into Framework and just do a soft reboot and it will be enabled. So this mod actually provides its own icon after enabling it, and you're just going to tap on it, gesture navigation. Uh, you're going to be met with the initial screen that's going to show you all the uh, multi-finger gestures you can perform. It says two finger, three finger, four finger, five finger. Uh, four finger and five finger are premium features as well as the uh, ability to blacklist certain applications. So the, the gestures won't work in these applications. Also, premium is the ability to use uh, pinching gestures, uh, pinching in and pinching out. But uh, I find it to work just fine with uh, two finger and three finger gestures. I don't really care for pinching, and I don't really care for putting four or my whole hand, five fingers on my screen. Okay, so you're going to go into two finger gestures or three. I'm going to go to two. Uh, there's a master switch. Uh, it's going to be like this initially. You're just going to switch it on. That's it. And then you're going to go into uh, the type of gesture you want to perform. There's a swipe left, right, up, down. Uh, right now I have it set up. Uh, but the first ones are system based actions. There's a, you can do no action. Uh, there's go home. There's back, recent apps, menu, play, pause tracks, next track, previous track, screenshot, torch, silent, vibrate, vibrate, silent. And then after that, you have a, uh, a list of all your apps that you can uh, quickly launch. So basically make shortcuts for them. But right now I have it set up to, uh, to uh, go to the previous track. If I swipe to the left and then swipe to the right, it goes to the next track. And this will only work if I have the... Um, a music player active. Uh, you can exit the music player, still have it active in the background, and you can perform this action from any screen. You can be in the browser, and you can uh, swipe, and it'll change track, so it's pretty convenient. Uh, you can swipe up. Let's do swipe up to uh, play pause track. So let's show you how this actually works. Um, it works with Spotify, it works with the Google Play Now, or whatever it's called, which is play music. So I believe it was swipe up. Oops. I was already playing. But the volume's on. Change track. Change track again. Sometimes it will actually swipe like a one finger swipe. So there you go. It's pretty cool. I mean, like I said, you can do it from any screen. I'm doing it from my browser, and I'm skipping tracks. So definitely check it out. It's a uh, it's gesture navigation, and um, yeah, all you need is to be rooted, have exposed, and then check out the full article because it's pretty detailed and it explains it a lot better than I am right now. I'm Nexus Seven Soft Modder. All the links are provided. Like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching.